This week's TNT Tech Tip is brought to you by Dead Downwind. Real science, real results. It's not just luck. Hi, I'm Michael Coppersmith. I'm the marketing director for Coppersmith Global Logistics and HuntingTrophy.com. We'd like to take a few minutes and bring you into the world of a custom broker and give you the information that you need to know before you go. We'd also like to take you through the process of getting your trophies back once they've gotten to the United States. So please follow me inside and we'll take you through it. We really wanted to talk to everyone about some of the processes that hunting trophies go through when they arrive into the United States. You actually have to deal with Department of Agriculture, Fish and Wildlife, and U.S. Customs Service. Once your trophies arrive into the United States at a Fish and Wildlife designated port of entry, the original documents are released to the customs broker. We do a document review and then transmit all of the data through the EDEC system, which is the electronic system that connects us with U.S. Fish and Wildlife. Wildlife inspectors are stationed at international ports, border crossings, and seaports across the United States. Once the shipment arrives and is declared to Fish and Wildlife for entry into the United States, we will inspect those shipments. Our inspectors will review the documents and they will open the shipment, inspect the contents, and verify that the species that are in the shipment are what is being declared. There are a couple of different types of shipments that we look at. Some of those shipments are fully processed. In other words, the trophies are mounted or they're tanned skins. They're easy to look at at that point. On the other hand, we get shipments that are unprocessed hunting trophies. These shipments are very high risk, so our wildlife inspectors must use personal protective equipment and wear respirators to protect them against certain chemicals that are used to process these trophies. Hunters need to be aware that the, as the importer of those hunting trophies, they must be the one to comply with the regulations. There are many brokers out there that handle the paperwork side of the clearance of those shipments. So before you go on your hunting trip, if you have any questions, you can contact U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service or a customs broker. We want you to be able to get your hunting trophies without problems. We know if you'll be traveling abroad, there'll be a lot of questions that you may have. So please feel free to contact us at any point, or you can check out our website at www.huntingtrophy.com. And please let us help you get your trophies home safely.